Hello guys, today I'm going to be showing you how you could get a custom recovery on your device, so yeah. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go into your Play Store and download this app called Root Rasher Flash Tool. So if you don't already have Root for your um, OGG Style 5.1.1 only, then I suggest you go to my uh, channel and check out how to do that. So you're going to open this app and you're gonna grant it um, you don't don't update this it doesn't really matter so you're gonna wanna download this link as well it is here it was in chrome, hang on uh, that's not it, Ugh. hang on I'll be right back when I get the link up, okay? okay so here's the link, I'm gonna leave it in the description for you guys um, I don't know why that's installing Anyways, yeah, I'm going to leave the link in the description for you guys so that you could download this. It's an image so that it will do that. So make sure you granted, uh, you're going to want to go into Rasher, as I said before, and after you installed it and stuff. So after you install the image, okay. So then you're going to want to go ahead and press recovery from storage, and then this will pop up. And you're going to want to go ahead and go to your download and press this one right here and then it says choosing TWRP 2.8.7 die or a whatever are you sure so yes flashing and then reboot into recovery now let's press yes and in a second you'll see that I have recovery installed now Here we go, Team Win Recovery Project. And now you have a recovery installed. Um, so this is where we could um, install and flash files and stuff. As you see in here, um, I'm going to be providing this later on for the Katana ROM and everything. So you'll still be able to, as you can see, it only works for T-Mobile and Metro PCS. So, if you try it on any other version, I am not responsible for what happens to your phone because you took the risk. Now, see, I already have it, but, yeah. So, um, now you have a recovery, and if you don't know how to do that, just press reboot and system. And give it a second and it'll reboot. You'll also get this boot animation when you do it. So, And that's it. Now you got a custom recovery installed on your phone. And... Later on, I'm going to show you how you could uh, finally get to the um, other process of installing this awesome katana ROM. So, yeah. Bye. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.